There are few things that say spring like spring flowering bulbs. They're incredibly fresh and brightly coloured, but most people don't realise that now is actually the time to plant them. There are so many varieties to choose from and growing them in tubs and pots allows you to bring them close to the house so you can enjoy them. Buying bulbs from my local supplier is a terrific way to go, but to get the best results, I've got to employ an old trick. You see, I've taken the bulbs and popped them in the crisper. Oh no, not those ones, or those ones. Oh, but these ones. And what's happened is I've left them at four degrees for about three to four weeks. What this does is it actually triggers the flowering process. So when they are planted, they take off like crazy and most importantly, come springtime, they produce the most stunning flower displays. The bulbs in my garden are going to be popped into pots and that means I need a special potting mix. This mix has special drainage rates designed to allow the roots of the bulb to grow quickly and set the base for a strong flower display. It has a special bulb fertiliser added as well and this makes the world of difference to the final result in spring. One trick with all bulb planters is to fill them full of bulbs and don't be scared to mix and match a bit. Adding colour splashes and extending the flowering period are just two of the benefits that come with planting a mix of flowers. Now remember, there are also some sensational fragrant bulbs available. Things like hyacinths and freesias, two of my all-time favourites. And the way to go with them, well, if you want to get really good results, mass plant them into big pots. Now, the benefit of this is, of course, you get a sensational flower display. But better than that, you can actually bring them inside the house and enjoy the beautiful perfume that they put out. The fragrance is just amazing. Now, this is the time of the year to be planting spring flowering bulbs. And come spring, you'll get a sensational display. The way to get them, well, pop into your local garden centre or do a bit of surfing on the net and check out the online catalogues. They're a terrific way to buy and of course, they're delivered direct to your doorstep.